This video will show you how to create a user account for the Seattle Services Portal. Click on Register for an Account next to the green Login button. Read through the general disclaimer, and then click the checkbox to indicate that you accept the terms. Then click Continue Registration. You'll need to supply your account information, including a username that you make up. In this case, we'll use Apply SDCI. You'll need to supply an email address, and this is important because you will need to verify your account via email once you've completed the application. Enter a password and then retype the password. Create a security question that you only you will know. In this case, we'll put my first dog's name. And we'll say the dog's name is Fluffy. Now you'll need to add your contact information. Click Add New and select a contact type. In this case, we'll select Individual, but you can also create an organization contact. Click Continue, and then supply your contact information. Ensure to fill out all required fields marked with a red asterisk. If you have a business or organization name, you may enter it. However, it is not required because this is an individual account. If this was an organization account, you would need to supply that information. Enter your mailing address. Your city, your state, your zip code. Supply a phone number. and again supply an email address. This email address could be different from your account information. This is where you'd like to receive information about your applications. In this case you can click continue. If you happen to accidentally click on add a row and follow through this doesn't really do anything. So go ahead and go to actions and click delete and then OK. Click Continue. You'll get this box that's telling you that the account is new and has not been created before. So that's a good thing. Go ahead and accept that and then click Continue Registration. Congratulations, you have successfully created your Seattle Services Portal account. You'll use that username and password to enter the account in the future. Now be sure to acknowledge uh, via email.